Hi, I'm Jeff Burris and this is Bethany Barnes. We're going to show you how to set up our, uh, our display booth. This is a 9.5 by 9.5 foot display. It was a custom size, so it's perfect to show you what we can do. It's uh, 20 pounds, 10 pounds. It fits in this bag. It's 8 by 8 by 32. First thing we're going to do, Bethany, is we're going to set up the cloth. And while you're spreading that out, I'm going to put the poles with it. This display is the backbone of what uh, what makes a really good inline booth for a trade show. It's compact. It's going to take you about five minutes to set up, and it'll serve very well for getting attention to your booth. It's real important when you're designing a, a booth that you keep your copy light and your graphic large, the point of your display is to draw people into your booth, not to be a flyer for them to read, because you don't have that much time to get their attention. What it really comes down to, what will sell your products is you and your booth. What we do is help you get the people to your booth. It might seem like a lot, but there are really only seven main poles here to put this together with. There are three that are similar, then there are two pair, and that's really it, except for the extensions if you want to raise the height of it. We're going to take advantage of that today by setting this up to be uh, uh, two feet off the ground, actually 30 inches, I believe, with some extensions. That works very well when you have an opportunity to set your booth up in an environment that uh, will allow you to go higher than the, the curtains in the booth space. Okay, Bethany, let's put the uh, side poles the side poles in to get the big one like this, and the notch goes at that end. Got it. And then we've got points across the bottom. And once all four poles are in the four pole pockets around the perimeter, we simply start at the bottom and put uh, put the tip of the the bottom pole inside the, the hole that receives it on the side pole. We're going to do the same on this side here. Okay. Did you want to get that one? Okay. On the top, it's even easier because there's not really a hole to go in, only a notch. And in this notch, we just take it, bring it up and set it in. That takes care of the, the basic frame is already put together now. And now we've got holes to go across the sides to add tension to take out any wrinkles that you might have. That means the pole turn where you can see the hole in the pole. Okay. Uh, let me show you the fastest way to do that. We'll use your pole as a tool. Okay. You can go over that side now. Back 
Then roll? Yeah. Okay. Alrighty. And can you see the hole on this one? Okay. Uh, you want a full section like that and use that to, to twist it. Keep coming a little further out. A little further out. There we go. Got it? The trickiest part of these is finding where that hole is. Let me help. You. Got it? Okay, oh, you're, you're perfect. Okay. And putting these on takes the wrinkles out sideways. Now we go back to the top. And we'll do this this way too. Check. These poles turn easier, so you can probably turn them with your fingers. Yeah. You got it? I have to line up the hole. Okay. Got that one. Okay. All right. Frames together. All the wrinkles are out. Now, we can, norm we can put the feet on right at the bottom of this, and this will sit at the ground. Or, we can put the feet on the ends of these poles. Get the pull the pin. Hold it. Put the pin on. manufacture this podium which the assembly of that can be seen in another video and we make a display to put the iPad in so you might have your own video running that you want to show and it drops in from the front and there you go groupimaging.com is our website you can call and talk to our staff anytime you like at 1-800 556-7222. Thank you.